Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Carlos. Good evening. How are you today? Fine, fine. Okay. Are you? I'm doing well. Okay. Thanks for asking. Okay. And how was the weekend? Uh, relaxed, teacher. Relax. Oh, relax. Nice. Do it. <laughs> yes. Cool. What relax. did you do? Uh, well, uh, the last weekend. Yes. Okay. I mean, in my house, all in my house. Well, the church and only relaxed. <laughs> okay, sounds nice. I'm glad to hear that you are relaxed. Uh, I was to make a homework with my daughter too. <laughs> oh, okay. You had to help your daughter with the homework. Yes. All right, that's nice. And you finished the platform, right, Carlos? Yes, I finished. You're done. Okay. All right, very well. Okay, see you another time. Let's see, Marvel, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How are you? Fine. Great. How was the weekend? How was the weekend? Excellent. Oh, nice. Tell me about it. Oh, nice. What did you do? What did you do? Uh, it was decent. Oh, you just stay home. Uh, you just stay home. Uh, stay home. Oh, all right. That's nice. Good evening, Anna. Good evening, Anna. And the platform, Marvel, are you done as well? Are you done as well? Mm, lección five. Mm. Okay, you're in the last Sí, todavía me falta el último check. Oh, okay. All right, you're doing well. Just remember, we got until Wednesday to complete everything, okay? Okay. Very good. Okay. Ana del Carmen, how are you today? Hi, teacher. Great. Great. How was the weekend? Um, relax. <laughs> oh, okay. Nice. Uh -huh. What did you do? Uh, I sleep. In... <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. That's nice. You had some time to rest. Yes. Okay, excellent. And let me see, Basilia, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How's everything? How are you? I'm fine, teacher. Great. How was the weekend? Um, <laughs> um, I helped my son with the study for the exam. For this, uh, what do you say, semana? Week. week. Uh, mm -hmm. For this week, because the next week is vacation. Yes, I right. Study, I study every day. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, vacation is coming soon. So it's yeah. very nice. Mm -hmm. Great, Basilia. Let me see. Flor Esmeralda, good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good. Excellent. How was the weekend? I was uh, visit uh, my family. Oh, okay. You visited your family. Nice. Yes. Okay, sounds good, Flor. Quiero solo sus oraciones por mi mamá que mañana le van a hacer la primera quimio. Okay, count on them. Sí, cuente con ya. ello. Ya. Primero Dios todo salga bien. Primero Dios. Uh, let me see, Diana Lisette. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you, Diana? Good, teacher. All right, that's nice. And how was the weekend? Relaxing in my house. Oh, cool. So you just stayed home. What did you do at home? 
And watch TV. Just watch TV. Okay. Sounds good. And the platform, Diana, are you done? Finish the platform. Okay, great. Let's see, Ailey, good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you today, Ailey? I'm fine. Nice. And how was the weekend? Um, my good. I visit my family. You visited your family. Nice. Do they live close to you? Uh, they live in Santa Tecla. Oh, okay. That's nice. And you, where do you live? Uh, I live in Chalatenango. Oh, okay. So it's kind of far. All right. So you had to travel. That's nice. And I think you finished the platform as well, right, Amy? Yes. You're done. Okay, good. Dina Ophelia, good evening. Dina Ophelia. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? Excellent. Okay, sounds good. And how was the weekend? Um, Saturday morning in my work. Okay. In afternoon, a student. Oh, you had to study. All right, that's nice. Yes. Good. In the platform, Dina, how are you doing with that? Excuse me? And the platform? How are you doing with the platform? Finish. You finished. Okay. All right. Yes. Excellent. Mm. Diana Jamilet, good evening. Good evening, Tisha. How are you today, Diana? Very good. All right. Sounds nice. And how was the weekend? Um um interesting oh really what happened um i was celebrating my hair's birthday oh, okay you had a birthday celebration that should have been fun yes, <laughs> yes. okay great i'm glad to hear that you had a good weekend and the platform vienna are you done too I'm finished. He's done. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Anderson Garcia, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today? I'm fine. Very Great. Fine. Okay. Sounds nice. And how was the weekend? A little tired because I have been working in a home or the university. Mm -hmm. and and they finish it yet. Oh, you have, have not time. finished. Yeah. Yes. Okay. All right, you have to keep going then. Thank you. And how about the platform, Anderson? Did you finish? I finished. Yes. You're done. Okay, perfect. Let's see, Charlie, good evening. Good evening. How are you, Charlie? You're fine, thanks. Mm, great. And the weekend, how was it? It was very good. All right. And what did you do? Uh, I I stayed in, in home. Okay. And the platform, Charlie, have you finished? Yes, yes. You did. All right. Great. Dina Contreras, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today, Dina? Hi, thank you. And you? Good. I'm doing well, thanks. And how was the weekend? Um, very good. Okay. What did you do? Uh, 
where you work. Um, very good. Okay. All right. Nice, Dina. Are you done with the platform as well? Uh, yes. You are. Okay. All right. Excellent. Thank you. All right, so I think we may start now. So once again, hey, good evening, everybody. Welcome to our last week of classes. This is uh, our 13th class. And we're going to start by checking the exercises we were doing last class, right? Remember that last class we studied the use of wood for making invitations. And we developed some different exercises to review the topics previously studied. So let's uh, take a chance to, or let's take a, some minutes to review that and to check the exercises as well. So let's see, the first exercise was making some invitations using would you like, right? Like, would you like to join me for coffee? So this is what we are going to do. I'm going to select different people. So they ask their classmates um, using the information here. So you just make an invitation to one of your classmates. For example, Ana del Carmen, would you like to join me for coffee? Mm, teacher, I, what do you mean in join? Um, join like um, acompañarme, unirse, mm -hmm. like, yeah. Yes. Go with me. Yes, All right. I, <laughs> I right. love coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. And uh, now let me see. Diana Yamilet, uh, do you make the next invitation to one of your classmates, please? Mm. The second one. Oh. Have lunch with me. Mm -hmm. You ask one of your classmates, would you like to? Do you like to? Remember we say, would you like to? So let me correct that over here. Remember that in order to make the invitations, we say, would you like to? Then we launch. For example, would you like to join me for coffee? Would you like to have lunch with me? Would you like to come to the cinema tonight? Okay. Would you like to have lunch with me? Okay, who are you asking? Um, a Carlos Antonio. Okay. Carlos Antonio. Would you like to have lunch, lunch with me? I love it. What kind of food do you like? Do you prefer sushi, China food? Tell me. <laughs> Very good. Okay, excellent. I, 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 I love it. I love it, the sushi. Oh, you love sushi? Nice. Yes. Oh, yes. I don't like it very much. It's yeah. Why, teacher? I can eat it, but it's not my favorite. <laughs> Octopus, squid, salmon, it's uh, everything. All this raw, yes, raw. <laughs> all right, sounds good. <laughs> all raw. <through. laughs> okay. Uh, um, Diana Jamilet, would you like to come to the cinema tonight? Yes, I love. Okay, you'd love to, nice. Now yeah. let, let me have another pair to ask an answer. That would be, yeah, let's see, Charlie, can you ask one of your classmates? Uh, okay. To so, Marvel, hey, would you like to play soccer with me? Yes, like soccer. Okay, okay. all right, very well. 
Yes, I love you. Yes, I love you. Yes, I love you. Yes, I love you. Yes, I love now let me see, Basilia, can you ask the next question to one of your classmates? Adriana, would you like to drink some tea? Yes, I like. I'd like to, nice. Okay, now let me have oops, Ailey. How about you ask? Would you like to come to the cinema tonight? To whom, Ailey? Uh, yes, I like to. Uh, who are you asking? Ask one of your classmates. Mm. Esmeralda? Okay. Would you like to drink some tea? Perdón, Esmeralda o Flor Esmeralda? Flor Esmer Esmeralda. Ah, vaya, eso soy yo. Perdón, <laughs> la pregunta, dígame. Uh, would you like to drink some tea? Yes, I like to. Okay. Very good, Flor and Ailey. Now, Ana del Carmen. Quiero una pregunta. Tell me. Este, la palabra si se dice ti. Yes, yes, that's ah, how you okay. say ti. Uh -huh. Okay, Ana del Carmen, now you ask. Yo le pregunto a Ana del Carmen, teacher. Eh, no, no, Ana del Carmen asks. Ana del Carmen va a hacer la pregunta. ¿A quién? Oh, then, eh, to whoever you want, a quien usted quiera. Mm. Uh -huh. eh, a Marvel. Okay. Would you like to have lunch? Yes, I love lunch. <laughs> okay, very okay. good. Now, Flor Esmeralda, you can ask. ¿A quién se lo puedo hacer, teacher? Es que no veo de aquí. Okay, I think Anderson Por hasn't favor. participated. So, Anderson? Anderson, would you like to join me for coffee? Yes, I love to. All right, excellent. Now, let me just uh, remind you about the ways to answer. Oh, wait a little. Uh, let's remember about the ways to answer the invitations. Remember, you can use different phrases. The most common ones, I'd like to or I'd love to, but we also studied some others. Let me remind you about it. And here we have them. So remember that in order to accept invitations, we can say, thank you, I would love to, I'd like to, that sounds lovely, what a great idea, thanks for your invitation, I'd be delighted to, sounds great, that'd be wonderful. So those are ways to accept the invitations. And then the most common ones, as I mentioned, I'd like to or I'd love to. Mm. And if you do not accept the invitation, if you refuse it, you can say, I would like to, but I, and then you explain it. I'd love to, but I, thank you for asking me, but I don't think I can, sorry, I don't think I can make it. So remember about the different ways to answer. Let's practice them. Everybody repeat. Thank you, I would love to. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'd like to. I love to. That sounds lovely. That sounds lovely. That sounds so lovely. What a great idea. What a great idea. What a great idea. What a great idea. Thanks for your invitation. I'd be delighted to. 
Sounds great. Great. Sounds great. Great. Sounds great. great. That'd be wonderful. That'd be wonderful. That'd be wonderful. That'd be wonderful. wonderful. Okay. Okay. You now say, I would like to, but I. I would like to, but I. I'd love to, but I. I'd love to, but I. Thank you for asking me, but. Thank, Thank you, you for, for asking me, but um, I don't think I can. I don't think I can. Sorry, I don't think I can make it. Sorry, I don't think I can make it. Okay, very well. Um, now let's continue by uh, checking the next exercise. So that would be... one for making the sentences with the verb be, right? So we have um, different uh, prompts. We got some different information. And we, we had to make some sentences using the verb be. For example, number one, I am Michael. Do you make it negative? I am not Michael. And then the question, what is the question? Are you Michael? Are you Michael? Good. Number two, who can make it? Let's see, Anderson. Hello. Can you make number two, please? All three forms. It, they will be right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. You yes. are my brother. Mm -hmm. Or are you my brother? Yep. In the affirmative? You are my brother. Very good. Thank you, Anderson. Diana Lisset, number three. Diana Lisset. Okay, Dina Ophelia, number three. Do you um, remember I'm to use, use the verb be? Am, um, is, or are. Here, number three. He, am, um, is, or are an engineer. Is, do, do he? He's an engineer. Okay, use the verb be. He is an engineer. Now make That's it negative, true. please. Mm -hmm. No. Uh, he he not he engineer. He's not an engineer. And the question? Can somebody make the question, please? He is an engineer. Is he an engineer? Is he an engineer? Is he an engineer? Very good. So we got yeah. he is an engineer. He isn't an engineer. And is he an engineer? Very well, now let me continue with Carlos, number four, please. Number four. Yeah. She's, pre she's pretty. Mm -hmm. She's not pretty. Is she pretty? Great. Number five, Flora Esmeralda. Yes. Can you make number five, please? Use the verb be. Am, is, or are. It is lovely. Okay. Negative? It, do. It isn't lovely. And the question? Uh, is it a lovely? Okay, very well. Is it lovely? Number six, Ailey. We are good friends. Mm -hmm. We are in good friends. Are we good friends? Okay, excellent. 
Adriana, number seven. They are co-workers. They aren't co-workers. ¿Cómo se dice eso, teacher? Yeah, you're good. It's co-workers. Co-workers. Ah, okay. Are they co-workers? Okay, very well, Adena. Thanks. Bodies, number eight, please. Number eight. I am a painter. Mm -hmm. I'm not a painter. Uh, are you a painter? Okay. Very well, boys. Thanks. Ana Veronica, number nine. He is my son. He isn't my son. Is he my son? All right. Very nice. And Charlie, number 10. They are my nephew. Uh, they are my nephews. And are they my nephews? Okay, great. All right, the next exercise was about making sentences in the, using the simple present, right? So we had to unscramble the sentences first and then just make them negative and interrogative. So we got the first one, which was we drink tea every day. Then we make it negative. What's the negative for this one? We don't, don't drink. We don't drink tea every day. And the question? Do you drink? Okay, let's use the same subject. Do we drink tea every day? So that is what we got. Remember that in the simple present, we use the auxiliaries do and does. And for the negative, don't and doesn't. So we got number two. What is the sentence? Anybody? Frank's. Frank studies, studies biology. Studies biology. biology. Okay, Frank studies biology. Oh, Make it know. negative. Frank doesn't study biology. Okay, now the question. Does, does Frank, does Frank study biology. biology? Yes, does Frank study biology? Everybody repeat, please. Biology. 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 Yep. Biology. Okay, number three. What's the sentence? This bears, bears has beautiful colors. Beautiful colors. Very well. This bird has beautiful colors. Make it negative. It don't. Don't or doesn't. This bird doesn't. 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 Yeah. That's beautiful color. Doesn't. This bird doesn't. It doesn't. Has. Doesn't. Remember that. It doesn't. That's a beautiful color. Okay, remember that here we have to change the it wait, the bird, bird. This bird doesn't, doesn't what's the verb? Have. Has. have, right? Over have. here, remember that has is the third person. But in the negative, we have to change it back to the base form. So this bird doesn't have beautiful colors, we say. Okay, now let's make the question. Does does bear does this bear does this bear uh, has beautiful color? color? Okay, does this bird have beautiful colors? Does this bird have beautiful colors? 
how it goes. Does this bird have beautiful colors? Okay, the next one. Number four, what's the sentence? Many shop close, close at seven o'clock. Good, make it negative. Um, many shops don't close, don't seven don't don't close at yes. seven o'clock. And the question would be? Do, mm -hmm. do, do, many, do many shops close yeah. at 10 o'clock? Okay, excellent. Number five, what is the sentence? A woman says, never says her age. Say. Yes, a woman never says her age. Okay, now make it negative. Does a woman? A woman don't, uh, doesn't. 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 A woman doesn't. And never, 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 Okay, in this case, we never would have to. We would have to omit the word never, right? Because never is already negative. So we cannot use a double uh, negative. So uh, in the negative, we would say exactly a woman uh, ascent say her age. age. Okay, now make the question, please. Does a woman say her age? Good. Does a woman say her age? Okay, number six. What's the sentence? The gardener. Cuts the grass. The, gra the gardener cuts the grass. Okay, make it negative. Does the gardener doesn't? The gardener doesn't? Cut the, the Cut the grass. And the question is? Does the, does gardener, does does the, the gardener? Does the gardener? The grass. Cut the, the grass. grass. Good. Everybody repeat. Cut. 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 Okay. Number seven. My father, my father, my father to Spain father, twice a year. My father, my father travels to twice. Spain twice a year. Travel. The negative is twice a year. My father, father doesn't. My father doesn't. Yes, my father doesn't travel to Spain father. twice a year. In the twice. question. Does my father does my father does my father travel to twice Spanish chair? Does my father travel to Spain twice a year? Okay. Twice a year. Let me type that for you. So it goes like this. My father travels to Spain twice a year. Then we make it negative and we say, my father doesn't travel to Spain twice a year. And the question would be, does my father travel to Spain twice a year? That's how it goes. Okay, number eight, what is it? <clears throat> we did three brush hours. We brush our we brush 
our teeth. We brush our teeth three times okay so we say we brush brush our teeth, our teeth three times a day negative we done brush we done brush our teeth three times a day And the question is, do we brush our teeth three times a day? Mm -hmm. Okay, number nine, we write the answers. Tell me the negative. We don't write the answer. We don't write the answers. And the question? He takes the, the bus. Okay, I guess the question for number nine, do we write do we the answers, right? Do we do we, do we, do we, do we write answers? Answer. Do we write the answers? Okay, and number 10, as somebody mentioned, he takes the bus. Make it negative, please. He doesn't take the bus. He doesn't take, take the bus. And the question is, does, does he take, a, take a bus? Does he take the bus? Good. The bus. All right, very well. Do we have any questions about any of the exercises? Mm. No? No. Okay, fine. All right, just remember, whenever we use the verb B, we refer to am, um, is, and are. But when we use the simple present, we use the auxiliaries do and does, and the negatives don't and doesn't. Okay, now I got some more practice for you. I want you to first talk about your daily routine. So that will be, I wake up at seven in the morning, then I take a shower, I get dressed, I eat breakfast, I go to work and so on, right? You talk about your daily routine. <clears throat> And then you are going to uh, write a corresponding comparative form of the adjectives over here. After that, in number three, I want you to make sentences using comparatives. For example, here we got cars and bicycles and fast. So what would be a sentence to compare them? Make a sentence. So it would the be car, the car is more fast than bicycle. Okay, cars bicycle. are, but what's the comparative cars. for fast? Cars are more fast or fast. Uh, in this case, we do not use more, we use faster, right? Cars are faster, faster yes. than, than bicycles. Bicycles. Yes, that's how it goes. So that is what you have to do, right? Mm -hmm. You use the information here to make comparative sentences. Cars are faster than bicycles. Elephants are heavier than ants and so on. Now in the next exercise, what you have to do is to compare um, living in a city and living in a town. So what's better? You can say, for example, it's better living in a city and you explain why, right? So talk about some reasons why living in a city or living in a town is better. Okay, do we have any questions before we go to the breakout rooms and work? Or we're good. Okay, let me send you to the breakout rooms. I'm sending you the practice to the WhatsApp group and I'll be visiting you in case you have any doubts, any questions. So let's go there and work.
Teacher, hi. De nuevo, no. me pasa lo mismo. Oh, really? Eh, si me puede volver a la invitación, por favor. Sure. Let me see. Una Verónica. And there you go. Eh, ya se la envié, no sé si le llegó, Ana. Ana Verónica, no sé si ya le cayó la invitación. Si me la envía de nuevo, por favor. Sí, eh, se la estoy mandando, pero no sé si no le llega quizá, ¿verdad? No, no me aparece. Ok, eh, intentemos una cosa. Si gusta, salga de la clase. Ah, y ah, ya encontré una. Ahora sí. Ok. Sí, encontré una opción de unirse. Uh -huh. Ok, muy bien. Mm. Eh, no entiendo lo que vamos a hacer. Ahí vamos a, a escribir nuestra rutina, ¿ok? Yes, it is talk, talk about you. Ah. La like rutina es speak, speech. Mm -hmm. um, speak and speech. Ah, oh, ok. Speaking. Yes. Um, speaking, yes. Speaking. I, I wake at uh, fine, fine. Y en, I am. Oh, oh my God! <laughs> Every day, It's Friday. Every day. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, este, uy, levantarse. Wake up, wake up. I wake, wake get up. up. Sorry. I get up. Mm -hmm. I get up at at fine. Eh, and take a shower at fine. Eh, fine. Um, I prepare I breakfast I go to the work at 6 I am um, my viaje teacher I travel Carlos what happened tell me uh, I travel, travel is, is um, travel is long Slow. Um, Largo. Yeah. Uh, slow. Uh, I I work um, um, far. Um, of I regresar, teacher. Come back. Come back. I I come back at at five five p.m. I go to the my house and at six six yes. and I I prepare I dinner <laughs> and I go to the bed at nine nine p.m. 
Night. Okay. But, um, about me. Okay. <laughs> I, I I I get up uh, 3:45 a.m. and uh, some sometimes I iron my I iron my my t-shirt, my pants, uh, or uh, at night, maybe at night. Uh, sometimes at night, and I prepare my my breakfast for. for Four or four fifteen a.m. and it and it sometimes it's uh, very <laughs> easy conflict milk and other and other time is uh, I prepare two eggs and microondas a microondas at microondas a microwave a microwave <laughs> sorry a microwave two eggs and beans uh, fries fries beans so. Uh, um, a cup, a cup, uh, a cup of milk. Sometime every every day, a four 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 thirty, and uh, I eat my breakfast. So next to uh, I go to the, the my uh, my factory, oh, my factory and the factory. I go to the factory in five a.m. a.m. And sometime uh, I arrive to the factory at uh, 6.30 or 7 o'clock, depend the, the traffic jams, depend, depend. Mm -hmm. uh, because I work, in, I work in Zona Franca, free zone, sorry, free zone, uh, Export Salva in Lourdes, Colón. Mm -hmm. I am I living in San Salvador. It's, it's so far. The, the time is two or one hour and a half or two hours uh, to travel. And I help my son. In... O sea, que, que no es que les ayudo, sino que estoy pendiente de que ellas se metan a las clases. <laughs> so you can say you, you, your class. Monitor, you monitor your kids so they get in the classes, for instance. Monitor uh -huh. sería como supervisar, como. Ajá, ajá. Perfecto. ¿Cómo me dijo? Monitor. I monitor, monitor. my I kids. I Morning. So, en la mañana. Ajá, en la mañana. Gracias. Ok. Entonces, voy yo. Eh, I get up at 6 a.m. I go to the gym. I take my breakfast. I start to work at 8 a.m. I end to work at 5.30 p.m. I have a dinner and I take the English class and I study. Faltaba alguien. Sí, ¿verdad? Diana creo que faltaba, ¿no? No, Diana creo ah, que ya pasó. Ah, ok. Ya estamos todos. Ah, ya estamos Ajá, todos. El, el ejercicio uno ya. Uh -huh. Ah, vaya, entonces. Okay. Yes. Aunque eso sí, no hemos llegado hasta las 12 de la noche, pero <risa> al menos una partecita. <risa> sí. Para continuar sí. el segundo ejercicio. La segunda dice uh -huh, es de adje adjetivos comparativos. Nos dan Ay, el sí, adjetivo y tendríamos. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces, entonces, en el primer caso bigger. sería bigger. Eh, bigger than, creo que es. Yes, that's Big, right. Grand. Uh -huh. Bigger than. Y el segundo. 
older than. Mm -hmm. Nicer than. Creo. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Okay. Prettier than. Mm -hmm. Solo le agrega el dan. Uh -huh. El dan. Cheap, cheaper dan. Cheaper dan. Y ese sería. More expensive. More, uh -huh. More expensive dan. More. ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo dijo usted? De sí, ex... sería more expensive, more expensive. than. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ajá, more. Good también se, solo se agrega el more, pero... Uh -huh. No, eh, no sería... Good, ya. Es irregular o algo así. Yeah, uh, es better than. Uh -huh. y, y de bad igual sería worse than. Uh -huh. Son irregulares. Hoy vamos con la número 3. Number three. Ese es de hacer las oraciones usando los comparativos. Yo esta sí no la entendí, estoy sincero. I can help you. I'm here. So what you have to do is to make sentences using the, the things that you got there, like comparing, right? So we got, for example, in the first one, let me get it here. We got cars and bicycle and the adjective fast. So we have to compare them, which one is faster, cars or bicycles? Cars. Car, car. Cars. So I say cars are faster than bicycles. Number two, we got elephants and ants in the adjective heavy. What can we say? Heavy. Yes. Heavy. Elef elephant. Mm -hmm. Elephants. Are heavier, are, are heavier than, than, and, than, exactly. and, oh, that's okay. how it goes. Mm -hmm. Continue. Mm -hmm. And brother, podría ser my brother, mm, Hamson. Is more handsome than me? Yes, you can say that. My brother is more handsome than me. Next. What do we say? We got Mount Everest, Mount Want, and High. Mount Everest is higher. Then Mount Blanc. Exactly. Yeah. Number five. 
Snake. Snake. R. Snake scar. R. Long. Longer. Longer. Than. Longer than. Warm. Warms. Okay. Next one, February, June, and cold. February is cold, colder, 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 than June. June. February June. is colder than June. Number seven, Chinese, Portuguese, difficult. Chinese. Chinese, Chinese is Chinese. more difficult than Portuguese. Chinese is more difficult than Portuguese. Number eight, I, my parents, and younger. Oh, that one is the comparative already. So we say... Ya está con el cambio. Let's just make the sentence. Then. I, I am younger than my parents. Exactly. I am younger than my parents. Next. My pencil, my pencil is shorter than yours. Mm -hmm. My pencil is shorter than yours. Next. Butterfly is prettier than bird. It's prettier than the bird. There we go. And the next one is, oops, I'll have to erase those. They mm. know if bigger, mm. huh? Bigger. If the rhino is bigger than um, the zebra. 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 And the last one. Parrot is noisier than canary. <laughs> no sé cómo se dice. Yes, the parrot is noisier than the canary. Okay, those are the sentences. Thanks, Any, no problem. Any questions about them? Are we clear? Eh, que es ants. Ants, hormigas. Yes. Uh -huh. Hormigas. Uh -huh. Ok. Y worms, snakes. Eh, worms, gusanos. Snakes, culebras. Uh -huh. O serpientes. Ok, so it's time to come back. I'll call you in just a couple of seconds, ok? Ok. Okay, teacher. Hi, everybody. Did you finish? Not teacher. No teacher. No teacher. Oh, okay. Uh, no did teacher. you get to exercise three at least? Mm. Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, don't worry about it. We are going to check tomorrow and we are going to complete if you didn't. So it's fine. So that will be all for today's session. Thanks, everyone. Take care. Have a good night. Good night. Thank you, teacher. teacher. Good night. Bye. Bye. Thanks. Bye. Bye, teacher. See you tomorrow.
Goodbye. Bye.